Hello you guys and welcome back to the Dufe channel. Today I'm going to be talking about all the products that I used myself and Duamel over the month of May. It's been a long month by now. There is a lot of things going on in my life and I'm very excited to show and share every single detail of it. You're seeing this on a Sunday, so please, 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 today will be the last day to enter the giveaway for the four products. And remember, this will be for any U.S. person or any people, any person who lives in the U.S., basically, will be eligible to get a slime glossing. This is a gloss by Jeffree Star Cosmetics, and we also have the Cutin Anti-Wrinkle Rich Moisturizer. Really great for the neck, the face, the back of your neck. It's really nice. And then we also have the Vichy. This is an um, hydrating serum that's basically going to help you reduce, allegedly, 40% less visible lines. Now, I've tried this one. If you want to know more, please go ahead and tune in on my video. And then we also have the fourth item. It's going to be a sleeping mask. This is a sleeping mask. is going to help you stimulate uh, kind of like just the obscurity, darkness around your room. So if you have a couple of part of, a couple of electronic devices that have like green and blue lights, this will help you rest in peace. But first, let's go ahead and have some water. You guys know hydration is the key to success. So let's go ahead and dive in onto the full box of products. I'm so happy to have this um, box. And I'm gonna show you the products. I'm gonna show you everything that I have here products that I have not used yet, like new products like this one, and like or like this one, and products that I have used. So this one's I recently opened them. I, I can't really tell you anything about them, but if you're always curious of what happened or if you want me to do a single video on products specifically, I'll let you know in the comments. Um, let me know in the comments down below so that way I can go ahead and make the video. So first off, we have the, this Ultra Repair Cream. This is by First A Beauty. This is a body moisturizer. It retails for between $30 to $35, somewhere like that. It's really good, really moisturizing, but I don't really like the stickiness of it. I don't think I will be repurchasing this one. I think that products for the face from First A Beauty, they were fantastic for me, but that one wasn't it. Next up, I have the All Thermal. This is by Avin. This is a lotion tonique du jour. And this is a gentle toning lotion. Um, now, let me tell you really quickly that this one is very good for sensitive skin. I don't have any issues with it. You guys know, I actually took some time off because of the L'Oreal hydrating or hyaluronic, um, let, me, let me double check right. Um, it has, it had exfoliant in it. It's a red one that I made a video and my skin really didn't like it. I felt, that it was overly drying and overly exfoliating for me. To the, and I, I don't think I actually used it for a long period of time. It just kind of didn't work for my skin and I actually had to step back from making videos because of how painful I saw uh, the process of my skin kind of recuperating and I didn't like it. I, I honestly don't think I would repurchase that one in. But this one is good. I really like it. I think I will repurchase it. Next up, I have this, the Perfect Men's Multivitamins. I lately, I have been coming into terms to kind of adding them onto my daily lifestyle. And to be quite honest with you, I have enjoyed them. This one's, I don't think I saw any benefits or any difference in my skin. This one's were on sale, by the way. They were about $8. Um, I don't know, I would have to try another one, but I like the brand, I like the, the fact that Majority of all these gummies or all these supplements are really fresh and you don't get to see them as often. Like when I go to GNC or the vitamin shop, which I have purchased items from them before, I notice that sometimes the expiration date is coming pretty soon. So I don't want to kind of live with that. And this one, when I purchased this one, it was, I think, uh, about two months ago. And this one expires in May 23, 2000 on May 2023, pretty much. So I'm very excited to see that. Now let's go ahead and dive in onto more products that I have here. I have this ones. This ones are from Domel. This is a Kali. He is obsessed with them. When he has the money, he goes and spends, spends on his perfumes. I used to buy perfumes for him, but now that he's a more independent woman, he, he loves to go and shop this one. So he purchased this one. I'm excited for him. And I personally think that, you know, they smell really fantastic on him. I, I really like them. The next one is the Kali 
K. Ali. This is the Amber 23. That's a little full collection, you guys. Like, like, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna find more in here, but he has a full collection unless he tries them. Um, next up, I have cotton. I like the Shiseido cotton. I know it is expensive, but it lasts very well a long time. It's very good for your for your whole face. And I don't think it actually, when you pour it on the, the lotion or the toner onto the cottons, I don't feel like it actually wastes the product. It actually holds it to the point where you can just actually apply the product and kind of like exfoliate in like a slightly exfoliation. And it's really nice. I like this one. I like it a lot. Talking about more Kali, K. Ali's. I have this one. This is a K. Ali Vanilla 28. And it, this one is one of my favorites for sure. This one. I'm pretty sure I can squirt a little bit more. There we go. Smells like him. Like every time I smell them, it smells like him. I love them on him. Don't get me wrong. I just think that they can be a little bit pricey. He's He has an acquired taste where he spends more money than I do on perfumes. I could never. Next up is this one. This is the TLC Sukari Baby Facial. Now, I love this product. You guys know how much I love it. However, I feel like... I have a lot of product in here and I'm going to open it because I'm not going to use it anymore. I felt like between me and Domel, like we couldn't utilize the, the amount of product that it's in here. So it is, um, I, I want to say it's almost halfway through. And we had a lot of product usage throughout the last year in this one. But I feel so bad that I'm, I'm literally wasting $70 or $80 going to waste it's it's so sad but if you want to find and a good exfoliator for your skin but you don't necessarily need the uh, scrubs this is the this is the way to go if you want to find more i also did a review on this one please go ahead and check it out and then uh, going back to the supplements i purchased this one this is one of one a day those are the men's gummies this is no high fructose corn syrup and this is good for energy heart health immunity health health muscle function, cell health, healthy nerve function. It's really nice because I in the mornings, I if I have the chance, I like to go ahead and just kind of like make juices. And my mom got, got us used to, ever, ever, ever since I can remember and being a child, she would always do a carrot juice and orange juice. Um, she would either do oatmeal or cereal or a huge shake. And let me tell you, my mom would literally like force me to eat it, to go to school, to come back and be full. Like, and on top of that, on lunch, she would go and, and buy me, you know, food. So it, it, it's, I think that juicing and being more mindful of your body, it's also self-care. So to me, that that's what it, that, that's how it's working for me. So I purchased this one. I'm pretty sure we're going to find more here talking about it. This ones are where Vita Fusion Kids Elderberry. Now this ones, you may say, why are you buying them? They were on sale, so I, I decided to purchase them and I, I have no complaints, but I, at this point in my life, I haven't seen any major results. So then we have this one. This one, you can buy it on high-end salons or if you are a licensed cosmetologist or a licensed esthetician, you can buy this one at Cosmoport or Salon Centric, one of those stores. This is by AG Beauty and or hair care and it ag has phenomenal phenomenal products for somebody who's looking to hydrate moisturize their scalp somebody who's looking to have that extra kind of a uh, extra care for your body or your hair and i really love them the scent it's marvelous but the product quality is really good majority of the times i use the ag when i feel like my scalp when i switch to another shampoo or conditioner and they are not working to my expectation and I, I'm starting to get in dandruff or really really dry and scalp uh, I try to be mindful with the water so every time that the water uh, I'm going to shower I'll always put it a hot and then I turn it into medium so that way when I jump into the shower I'm not like overly drying my scalp because that was a major issue for me next up I have this Nivea pampering body wash I purchased this one because it was on sale on Amazon like two three dollars and regular price is like five dollars I decided to get this one because it says that it has vanilla and sweet cream. The scent is good, but the product wasn't the most amazing. I think that I'm just used to uh, dope. That, that that one was like, eh, it was just okay. Next up, big disappointment, guys. I wouldn't repurchase this one. This is by Jeffree Star. 
Domel, don't get me wrong, Domel loved it. He said that it was amazing for him. He really liked it. It was a good bomb. But for me, it was just like, eh. Packaging is gorgeous, beautiful, insane, outrageous, but not for me. Next up, I have this Laura Mercier. This is an almond coconut milk body butter. L listen, if you're one of those people who really enjoy uh, fragrances like me, and you either go to Bed and Butter Works or, or I don't know, let me say, Pink, and you go because you like certain scents, this is gonna be amazing. It smells so good, you guys. It smells super, super good. If you wanna, if you wanna give to, if you're gonna gift a body cream to somebody who you you are unsure, Laura Mercier, guys. Laura Mercier is the one to go. I really like them. I think they're marvelous. I think they're outrageous. I just really like them. Next up, I have this Jaffra Beauty Dynamics. This was given by my friend Brenda. I loved it. It was really good. I tried several times. I got, I finished it up, you guys. My skin first marvelous, and I don't feel like it over exfoliated my skin. I think it just works fantastic for anybody who, like me, have sensitive skin. Uh, so, and when I say sensitive, I mean like I can get rashes of dryness and I can get really, really dry immediately. Like, ah, my skin, I love it. Next up, I have this Naturium Fermenta Camellia Creamy Cleansing Oil. Naturium has one of those products. It's one of those brands who releases products every single month, I think. And to me, I feel like I enjoy the, their cleansers are amazing. I actually have a couple of uh, of the Naturium products and I haven't indulged into them. I don't know why, but this one was good. It wasn't the best for me. This Domel loved the oiliness. He said that it worked fantastic when he was dissolving the makeup. When you want to do the double step, this is the way to go. Next up, I have this Pure Heels by Nature Village. I think I have another one, by the way. This is the Centella Reviving uh, Toner. It's more of a smoothing, softening, kind of like neutralizing and calming your your skin with the toner. I personally didn't see any major results. I felt like it was just more calming than anything else. So I would definitely say that this is great for somebody who's looking to calm and neutralize and kind of like relax your skin. If it's irritated or if it's annoyed at, at a certain product, this one is good, but I don't think I'm gonna repurchase this one because I already have another one. This one, this is a anti-aging hy hyaluronic acid serum. This one works fantastic. This is a good hyaluronic acid. If I'm not mistaken, I may have another one in here just because this one is so inexpensive and it's so good for what it does. And you don't have to overspend money for like $40, $50. I think that, you know, you get you get what you pay for and you don't have to worth the money. Talking about Naturium, this is one of my favorite cleansers. I really love it. I think I actually got this one by through the a Aia Beauty bundle. So that's like a subscription program where you can you know purchase the box for $40 and it comes with almost a hundred or almost sometimes two hundred dollars products. I really like it. Now let's talk about teeth. This is called Gate Renewal. This is the best toothpaste I've ever tried. I got into couponing, I want to say four months ago, and let me tell you, I have plenty of toothpaste, plenty, plenty of toothpaste because I coupon a lot. And uh, this one was one of my favorites for sure. This is very expensive. This is, tends to be like nine to ten dollars. It's very expensive. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, it's super expensive, but I definitely recommend it. It's not like a regular toothpaste. It's um, it's a gel, and it's almost like turns into the, like a paste in your mouth but it's so refreshing and you are actually looking forward to wash your teeth. So I really love it. I think that this is marvelous. It's something that I would definitely repurchase again. Now talking about repurchasing again, I already have a couple of extra ones of this one. This is a hydrating eye cream. This is really good, really affordable. I would definitely buy it again. I think that one is phenomenal. Now let's go ahead and dive into this one. This is a Kiehl's Ferulic Brew Rejuvenating Facial Essence. This is a cool, essence however it is expensive but you get what you pay for and majority of the times you're not going to use it in the winter time or on you know there's certain occasions so if you're on the oiler side you definitely want to use this one almost every day however for my skin i felt like i needed to step within the winter because i get overly dry and i don't want to overly exfoliate so for me it was a really good purchase i would definitely repurchase it again if i needed to 
right now i'm fully stuck on essences and i don't think i'm gonna be needing it but if you're combo to oily skin this is really good this is gonna neutralize and kind of exfoliate your skin but at the same time it's gonna help smooth and soften the texture of your skin and i really like it this is something that you just pour like four to five different drops or like maybe 10 drops and literally you can get drops out of this one because the dispenser is really really like dropping and basically you can pour the drops into your hand and it's really indulging to your skin i really like it so i would definitely repurchase that if i have to next up i have one of the best sunscreens i've ever tried and this one was a gift by donnell so this is the Coles rx this is the spf 50 plus remember as many plus as they have the better protection you have against uv rays so this is spf 50 plus pa three pluses like this is really good the really nice i really like it i was a little bit hesitant way way before it was mentioned by my friend dear friend jasmine which is a makeup artist by the way and she is a phenomenal what she does so she recommended me one time she said you need to try maybe more korean products and cos rx is one of the ones that you need to try and i decided to try them and we started purchasing them and oh my god you guys they are so good and the price is not expensive. I think this one was like between $15 to $20. It wasn't that bad. I really like it. Next up, I have more supplements. I have elderberry. Apparently, elderberry has been here for a while. So this is supposed to boost the immunity system. It's a blend of elderberry, vitamin C, vitamin D, and zinc. And I really enjoy it. I think that gummies, aside from just regular pills, I like them. And again, all is a brand that I really, really enjoy so far, as you can tell. Next up, I have this one. This is by Alicia Keys. And if you didn't know, go on to our YouTube channel, find the Alicia Keys review because you're going to find out that, guess what? Alicia Keys um, is under the umbrella of L Cosmetics. However, this one, it can be a little bit pricier, but I really like this uh, toner, relaxing. I miss this product. And I'm not going to buy it because I have so many other ones that I need to try. It. But this is one of the products that I really enjoy, not only because it calms and, and tones my skin, but because it's also the essence of it, it kind of relaxes me. And every time I would read it in the back, it says, I am free as the air. And I really like, I, I like the whole vibe of Alicia Keys. You guys know how I feel. And if you guys want to find out more, find it on our review. Going back to more Laura Mercier. This is the Perfect Cream Multitasking Moisturizer. This is a cool moisturizer. I really like it. It's not the best but it's a, it's a good moisturizer, don't get me wrong. It's like, mm, it's good. It's good for what it does. Let's see what else we have here. We have the Jeffrey's, we already talked about it. I would never purchase it, just, just not. We have another Coast RX. This is a mini travel size of the Essence. I like that one. You gotta wait on to see the history of who. You have to wait. I have more history of who right here. I have a nice, nice moisturizer. I like this one. That one's good. Let's see. This is the Avena Restorative Skin Therapy. This is this is nice. I like it. A hand cream by Amazon. I like it. It's not the best, but I like it. This is the Kate Somerville Exfoliate. You guys know I love this product. I love it. I love it so much. And then. I have this one. This this took me a, a long time to finish it. This is the Trader Joe's Pumpkin Overnight Face Mask. This one was good. It's really good for exfoliating your skin and just going to sleep. This is a mask that you want to add on to if you want to go into more anti-aging or more care aging, if that makes any sense, products. I have this one. This is the Buffet. I, I didn't care for it. I think that they could have done better. And last but not least, I have this one. This is the Navigo Ocean. I love this product. Every time I put this one on, they ask me, what fragrance are you using? And that's the one I'm using. So with that said, you guys, I hope you guys liked this video. If you guys have any questions in particular of any product, let me know in the comments down below, and I'll be more than happy to do a full review on that one. Thank you guys so much, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.